everyone, Game Master Cody here again. And now, as we approach our next location, go ahead and save it up, and we'll get to the reason why I hate Australia. Yes. Fall back! I would not get so near if I were you. Not for long. So yes, we lose Idriel in our party temporarily. Which sucks. Ramia abandons the city. We will be surrounded. You must leave her. I will not fear again. Then we shall die. They fill the city. Boromir once spoke of sewers under the city. We must find them. Yes. Deeper into an occupied city speaks of wisdom. Why do we delay? We must take to the rooftops to avoid the main orc force. Hurry! See, it just says there we have to. I mean, see, we lost Idriel right now, which is really annoying. So there's no R of the Valor, no healing, none of the good stuff. And when she's by herself, the come, we have to deal with some it. of the guys that can stun, which is annoying. I know you lurk here. <sighs> I hope I don't get stunned. Okay, it's two archers. Yeah, I can do it. What am I doing? Just kill them both and be done with it. Just when you get the shields, that's what you gotta worry about. Because if they stun you, you're screwed and they're just gonna keep killing you. Really you have no bear to cast stand. Why it's always good to focus on spirit attacks because even if you were taking, focusing on melee attacks with her, they would have kept you from attacking, so. And what sucks is they keep switching to Bear Thor as your main person every single time, which is so annoying. Because I don't want to be Bear Thor, I'm half hide. So I want him to get the most experience, so. This guy, yes, no, there is no uh, Idriel that can help us out here. That's why we have to cast Crippling Smash over and over again. Now, this is actually where Shield of Courage is your best friend, it grants immunity to fear, which, needless to say, that. We examine this guy. He's got 88,000 more health and 60,000 AP. See, so he's not immune to slow, which is good. But he's normal to everything else, so. Let's go and give him a good creature bane. Oh, hey, it's only still the critical, though. Have had some help. At least I have Royal Grace though to re regenerate some health every now and again. And now I'm just gonna leave Had Hod right here for now because if I keep trying to switch him out every time if you do an Israel fight it jumps back and Bear Thor's gonna be in charge again. So just one of those deal with it and move on. See that kinda sucks because you have to use one of the people that 
may have not been using most of the time. Keep casting crippling smash to keep him from attacking because he's very strong. If I keep giving some good, uh, and always make sure you have Shield of Courage active. That should be your first priority with Barathor because that immunity to fear makes all the difference in the world. Because if he casts fear on two of your party members. Well, he can't move. Two company mice had out stronger. Oh, and Elagos. I do not want him attacking. There we go. Shoot the bird is still up. Hey, learned arrow for you. Awesome. Learned a new power. These are all tedious fights, so... This is how it's looking like now. Still at 49,000. As far as damage... Crippling... This is shattering, striking. Deactivated. Activate it now. Alright, he's got all his health back. That's awesome. Yes, with crippling smash on your side, this fight becomes hilarious. As long as he doesn't miss, then at that point you're screwed. So, steal on grab. Flurry would do good if there was more than one foe, but there's not. We're gonna aim shot for a stronger attack. I think the creature bane is a damage. Fellowship Grace is still activated, as well as Shield Carnage. Be a good idea. Going 
we'll slow him down again. Then we can do, do, we can do Rampage of Durin next. Go ahead and examine this guy. He has 4,000 health left, so. I thought you'd be able to kill him. Oh, nope! Elagos gets the kill. Nice! The critical hit, animal bane. Creature bane. Alright, my video's uploaded. I'll probably finish for a while, but. Oops, there we go. And that's why you want Shield of Courage. Oh, hey, look at that. What if I learn Crippling Shot, actually? That'd be better. Arrows of Sleep. That's his fantastic move. Oh, she got overwhelming blows. That's good. And we didn't have to go this way if you didn't want to... We're going to, we're going to have to fight... Now. And this guy is a jerk. Oh no, there's an idiot who can. He's still more devastating. So. If I keep clicking smashing. Yeah, he's fragile against Slash, and strong against Water. Not immune to stun. Hmm. He'd be dead by the time the thing happens. Nope. Oh, and he dodged, so... guy does not attack ever. Get some more health back. I had a losing health for it. Yes, I'm going to keep testing this over and over again so he doesn't attack. It's a great idea. Yeah, 
probably won't do any damage against that guy, but... Oh, wow, he's, he's still does some decent damage against the Grim Wraith. I'm surprised. Figured he'd be really strong against Spirit. Let's go ahead and hit this guy with everything we've got. Wow, triple critical. I love getting those. Not receiving, getting. Ooh, shoot a courage, shoot a courage, shoot a courage. Just in case that hog misses. That hot time. Oh, I still get to go again before the ring race. Time to bring the pain. Seventeen thousand health points. All right, double critical. It's always fun to do. Sounds good. Thank you. 
projectiles on the blunt defense. And Hedgehog gets a new battle axe, actually. Wow, really? That's so weak. Compared to... No! Wait, it's stronger. What am I doing? What am I talking about? Ah, it decreases all the stuff, though. Yep, polished up on a blunt defense. Everyone's good against blunt, actually. She gets new steel pauldrons, though. Alright, one more fight. Hopefully I can kill this ring right to fight the Battle of Idril again. And that safe spot by the floor. goes for Hadmon every single time. Okay, we have another... Ah, oh, dang it. Can stun. Crippling smash this guy anyway. He's still too dangerous. Okay, that's actually good. I can kill him. And him. Okay, that works. We need some more health and action, health and action points. Well, had to have some health. Grace and Murder Grace on. So why not company might to make ourselves stronger? There we go. Let's get a good AP regeneration. Should have courage is gone already. Die. 
without getting it hit. I got Let's see, piercing might pierce a little bit. Creature man. but surely dying. That's good. Wow! Missed. That's perfect. Shoot of Courage is still up. Okay, that's good. Fights are tedious, so just expect that. Don't worry, we'll kill him. If he doesn't miss this time. So I had hot slowly get his health back. That's why you want to do that just in case. There we go. That was so bad. Oh, 1,214. Yep, Elagos is going to get the kill again. Oh, wow, he's done. And we're finished. Yes, there we go. a very valuable safe spot. Yes, most of the time they're always valuable, but especially now when you don't have Idrael, because some of the Idrael fights, she will die. And you have to go back to do some stupid crap. Like, I don't want to, I don't want to have to repeat those th three ring right fights again. Now she dies, I'll have to repeat one. 
Can we get any new equipment? No. She got skills. I guess you can learn that. Doesn't matter. Double attack. Eh, it's getting close to crippling shot. Airs asleep. Only one more way. That's good. Ooh, paralyzing shot. That's good. Spirit of the North. Bangorn Bash. Okay. Still has a lot more for Gondor Rampage. And I'm not really using spare craft right now, but we'll craft because other buddies are way too valuable. Second game master currently signing out, and I will see y'all next time as we continue as Goliath.